Damn. Is what you're a beast. Candon's jade of the seven months. I appreciate that. I can sell my gain so I'm back up now. Yo, boosted panda with the three months. Nobody panic with the nine months as well. Hmm. But yeah, the uh, the games are nuts. But uh, my bad for not going live uh, past few days since the uh, the, the octopus games. I've had the, a huge headache. I was up super late and I was trying to, you know, manage the whole event and shit. The most part is the front man. Fuck me. My head was hurting after that. I had the devs in one ear while I was talking and listening to other people in the other ear. Oh my fucking god. Blue. But uh, yeah, it was uh, I think it went pretty well, all things considered. <clears throat> it was like minimal scuff when it comes to scuff things that can happen, right? Wise wiggle. Frontman got big KD. <laughs> True. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, fuck. <sighs> So I think the first game was one of the was one of the best. Uh, to be honest, it wasn't exactly how we like uh, how we planned it out. I had a big uh, say in like the design for the first game, um, but I wanted to do a game where it's like, hmm, especially the first game where it's very RP oriented, right? Where you've got to interact with more people and like. Um, and open up the options for having friends or like making those people like your enemies, right? Huh. And uh, it did change in a way that was I was kind of annoyed with at first, but you know it turned out to be like really good. Because when uh, people grab their relics, right, and you can only grab one, and you couldn't drop it. Oh shit! <laughs> and then like someone you just uh, you just teamed up with grabs that relic as well, like. You're both not going through that same uh, airlock, you know what I mean? Hmm. And then people start panicking like, oh shit, I've got to find the new group. <laughs> it was so fucking good. Oh god. And then Rami fucking yoinking that one of the last spots by punching the fuck out of that guy. Oh my god. Absolute content, man. Dante. <laughs> oh, so good. I think Beyond had the same idea as well. Like, I think he started punching the shit out of a uh, pond. Uh. Did you see this? No, what is it? Why did you say not to fucking pick the people you like, you dumb fuckers? That's the information we passed on. I don't know if it's true or not. Okay, some of it is bullshit. Vinny, some of it is true. What the fuck are you doing? Listen, everything I've told you so far has been true, right? Why? Vinny, you're so dumb, bro. <laughs> like, what the fuck are you doing? What are you, what are you talking shout, about? Shout louder, bro. I was literally whispering. Oh my god. Good shit, Vinny, bro. No, D, no. No, man. It's not like that. <laughs> bro, Vinny, man. Vinny, 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 Vinny just... So this was before the maze one, right? If it was snakes are hot in the first one, yeah, that's why it's so good. Because it was like we had to we had to reduce the amount of slots a lot by the first game, the red light, green light, right? Because if there's too many people in red light, green light, it'd be super scuffy. But the way we had to do the first game was we needed to spread everyone out so the VoIP wasn't super scuffed. And it wasn't really laggy and shit. So that's why the using the whole island for that was uh was really good. And have those multiple airlocks around the island to keep people spread out. Hutch getting away. Yeah, I think he went into like the water or some shit and then went through the elevators. <sighs> Dude, one of the best parts of the... <sighs> of the Octopus games was Mike Block and... And, um... And Nidas. Was the old man. Oh, was so fucking good, dude. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, absolute fu oh, it's so good. The one thing I, I really wish we didn't do, and I don't know why we did it like this. 
Um, the last game was a PvP game, which I think I think the last game was really shit to be honest. I'm not gonna lie. The game I wanted to do that me, uh, Mike suggested it actually. Um, when we were we were brainstorming the initial games, uh, was a game called Carrot in the Box. Hmm. Let me try and pull it up. Should be a more RP oriented game. Cause when uh when we were coming up with the games, um, there was a lot of games in there that weren't very RP oriented at first. So I made sure to organize a meeting with the devs to get some of those more RP style games in there. Um, I think the marble game was one of the best RP games, to be honest. RP show lucky, yeah. Oh, let me pull it up. Here it is. But we do like gun in the box. Look inside your box. Okay. So, Sean, you can look inside your box. John, you cannot look inside your box. So you have to be two boxes, right? <clears throat> one of these boxes, you can you can look at... Uh, one guy can look in the box, right? And if it's got a carrot in, then you have to uh, you have to say... Like, you have to try and say something and then convince uh, the other person whether, you know... Like, you could be lying. You could say, I don't have a carrot in my box, but you actually do have a carrot in your box. And then he would have to call your bluff. And then he wins, right? Or if you say there isn't a carrot in my box... Then he says there is, but there actually isn't a carrot in your box, then you win, you know what I mean? Now we could do like multiple rounds of that. I think that would have been funny as fuck. Obviously there's no facial expressions, but still you could still try and fuck someone up in RP like, uh, you know, just by voice and shit. By doing that. Dude, I think that would have been sick as like one of the, some of the last games, like narrowing it down like that. Chat would have spammed yay or nay, Here's true. Month, my guy. Hope you're feeling but can't you disable yay or nay, uh... Yay or nay comments? But yeah, I told everyone to go into emote only for the first game. Which seems to work pretty well. Like, if you're in emote only, like... <laughs> I'm sure some people were trying to, like, somehow figure out how to... To meta it, but... There's, like, no way you can really meta that first game in emote only, to be honest. Just counter spam, yeah. But to be honest, a lot of the big communities would like be on the side of their streamer, you know. Yo, Kavas with the eight month free, so appreciate that, dude. And on the marble game as well, <laughs> Glorion. I think it was who was left. It was Glorion. Um, was it Penny? Uh, and uh, yeah, Glorion. Uh. Yeah, killed Penny. And then he was going to take her marbles. But fucking Francis. <laughs> oh, yoinked Penny's fucking marbles. And then I, I, I said to Gloria, I'm like, yo, give me these 24 marbles or you're going to die. So then what Francis made him do was, uh, I can't remember what he, what he made him do. Hmm. Oh, yeah. So, so Dundee and... Was it Dundee? Yeah, it was Dundee and the... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, Guy Jones. We're doing a head-to-head, -head, like, uh, standoff. Like a Mexican standoff. <laughs> and then I think when Guy went down, fucking uh, Glorion just went in there and yoinked his marbles. <laughs> so he could give them to me. And then they both got eliminated anyway because they shot each other. Oh, fuck. Which character was I? I was the front man. This is the front man speaking. Yeah, the VIPs are great. Yeah, so I was I was like the event organizer for the day. Pretty much. 
but there was like a hmm there's like seven or eight other devs in like a, in discord i was obviously talking to them that's why i couldn't stream it because i was talking to them oc in discord a lot you know trying to give direction and making sure the other devs were setting up games and doing stuff at the right times and all that sort of shit, right keep things flowing are the bets canon um i don't think they are i think they were just like meme bets because obviously it wasn't on the live server so like i think it would have been good to do the diamond hand bet stuff but it wasn't like the live server would have mattered anyway thanks for calling kyle the with french accent was hilarious <laughs> oh you know the cops being in there too as the guards in the um I got fucking blasted at the end by the cops. Get out of there, though. We're going to do some more stuff in the future as well as frontman for, uh, for the police and whatnot. Randy getting his money? Yeah, R Randy's getting his money. That, that whole part about the money wasn't fake. And the whole part about hacking bank accounts isn't fake either. <laughs> People haven't had their money taken yet. Hunger Games? Uh, I'd have to rewatch the Hunger Games again. That, that could be cool. I mean, it'd essentially just be like Battle Royale, right? So. But like, uh, we could do it on the island where we have like different like things that come in that can take you out and shit. Might be better if we do it like with a lot of people though it'd be better to do it over a massive island you know what i mean <laughs> harry potter goblet of fire hmm yeah i think doing more events like that'd be sick but dude dude the actually the uh the devs are cracked they did all the 3D and uh, they did all the 3D and all the code in this short amount of time. It was like two weeks to put it all together. Yeah, okay. Fire with a form of free sub. Reach to that one. Souls with the two months. Gido with a form of free sub. Faster again with the eight months. Alex Jacobs with the prime for three months. Thank you guys. Deviant there with a 50 gifted bomb. What an absolute beast. Get some love in the chat for Deviant there. Deviant, you're an absolute beast. I appreciate the 50 bomb. That team contributes to made it so good. Yeah. Dude, the uh, dude, the the airlocks and the elevators and like the um, hmm, like the relic points where you got them from. Uh, they, dude, they were so good. I think it was Z that did those. Let me just double check. Yeah, for game one, the island assets, all the placements and shit, that was done by Z. I was saying what they should look like and how we should do them. So the the initial idea um, which it was pretty similar in the end anyway was and it, um, I'm glad we didn't do it this way to be fair. The initial idea was you had to stand on like a circle platform right? With four of the team members Huh so the initial idea was you would stand on like this relic spot, right? With four other team members. And then you would get like a, a relic. One of you would get a relic. 
uh, and it would tell you what shape was the next one, right? And you would have to get a code and put it in in a certain order. So you'd have to go around finding all the different relics in the right order. And then you would go to an airlock and then you would all stand on it at the same time. But if, th if there was less or more than five people on it for in that 10 second space, then it would uh, fuck up. I'm glad we didn't do it like that because <laughs> there's so many people piling onto some of them. It would have been impossible. So I think the way it ended up being was, was perfect, to be honest. Yo, Link, see with the three months. Appreciate that. Staring was amazing. Yes, yeah, so that was done by Darker. So... Yeah, Darko did a stairs room and the red light, green light room. Penta was laughing so hard when you asked him, do you fuck? <laughs> it, it's weird. It was weird because like the way I would say it in my accent, I'd be like, well, what did he ask me again? Like, I think he said, do I get to keep the shank or do I get protection? And I was like, do you fuck? But I said it in a way that was just kind of like a blunt question of, do you fuck? You know what I mean? <laughs> I was saying it and I was like, do you fuck? Fuck off. But I <laughs> said it in a way that was just like, just straight up with a question, do you fuck? Ugh. <laughs> 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 uh. The meme in his channel. Oh god. <laughs> but he cut yourself off from saying something. Nah, it just wasn't said in the right way, especially behind the voice changer as well. It just didn't come out right. Not to mention it was like fucking 3 or 4 a.m. for me. I was like that whole event I was running on fumes. Hmm. <clears throat> Red light, green light was good, but it was a bit scuffy. Um, so the, it was like red, red markers would come up above people's heads. Um, but some people with bad pings would like, it would desync and show them still moving when they actually weren't. So that's to give a bit of leeway to people with like bad ping, right? And then I was right in front of X trying to trip him up. And uh, I was looking at someone down my scope, like past him, because I was making it look like I was going to shoot X, but I was actually shooting someone past him. And then uh, I, th I think he moved. Like at the time, I wasn't sure if he moved. Like while I was looking down my scope, he was in like my peripheral vision as I was about to shoot the other guy. He didn't get a red marker above his head. Because um, he, I think he moved like a fraction. I had to go back in his VOD to see if he moved, but... Could have shot him there. I need to smack the fuck out of Penny twice in red light green light. <laughs> what? What? Did you like punch her or some shit? Yo, it's JJ with the form of resub. I appreciate that. <laughs> I was scared to death. Oh, fuck. Dude, I love just like it on... I mean, like green light, I would like walk up to someone, like right up to them. And uh, I'd get right in their faces if I was about to shoot them. Oh, dude. The panic is so good. Yo, Oreo's mate with a tier two for 22 months. Appreciate that. J with the four months. T with the form of resub. Wise Boris with a tier luck. three for 13 months. Boris, you're a legend. Legend. Tommy got supply by Rami Rani. I didn't really see Tommy much at all during the event. I couldn't pick him out a lot. Dude, tail grab. Oh, fuck. Tail grab was so good as well. And I think Yuno and X got eliminated like the first wise two. Flag flunk wise, dink dong wise, flag flunk wise, dink dong wise, flag flunk wise, dink dong wise, flag flunk wise, dink dong. Yo, Jamie's still with the seven month resub. Appreciate that. Wait, what is this? Oh, yeah. And then the game. So the way we did it with the games, right? Is uh, the. 
you know when you got people in teams of two people probably thought it was going to be the marble game so like oh shit get get uh teamed up with someone you don't like but it was actually a team game so we kind of thrown a curveball in there it's like okay so you gotta do a, a team game for this right when you're in teams of two but then we made you keep those teams for the for the game after where it was you were against each other you know so it ended up being both and then for the uh, the mannequins as well, the three mannequins, front, middle, and back. If you chose the back, then you were at a disadvantage. So for the tail grab, the way it worked is if you're at the back, you would start without a tail. That makes sense? If you selected that back group. Yeah, dude, I didn't know fucking Zerka was Zerka, bro. I thought it was Benji, bro. So I stabbed him because I thought Benji was running up to me to take my shit. Did he, did he bleed out? Yeah, did Rami have a knife in the um for the Ford GT. Who gave Come Rami a knife in the love it. Just in the uh till it gets a fixed the way to now, I'm wrong, some cute ass. Ash, where the fuck did Bas get a knife from? Yo, Auntie Frost of the Prime for two months, appreciate that. Cause uh you guys saw with Mike Block, like we gave him a knife specifically to go and stab Abdul because he had his invite taken, right? And then we made sure to take it away because we didn't want people just getting stabbed for the waiting room bit. Because, I mean, even in the show, that was a bit of a kind of shit portion of the show, right? So we didn't just want people going around stabbing everyone on the fight night and eliminating them. So I just did a big area revive in that point anyway. So anyone that was downed in that part of the game should have got revived anyway. Those are very good. Look at you since here, man. In April, yeah, I said, I said stop. I think I said stop fighting. Um, and then April just carried on fucking swinging, so I made sure she got shot. Bro, I started getting a headache like halfway through the... Uh, Halfway through the games, I was just looking for people to eliminate. Because that was going insane. <laughs> My favorite Trying to was manage Mike everything. Out April with the mounted MG. Oh, so satisfying, man. The power. <clears throat> Yo, Anti Frost of the Prime for two months. Uh, Apicos of the Tomb of Resub as well. Appreciate it. But man, that's copper shot. What's this one? Yeah, I could try. I was trying to point. I was trying to find the cops because the obviously the devs had specific instructions on how to get rid of the bodies, right? But the cops were escorting them a little bit to, <laughs> to places, so I could pick out the. It's, I didn't know it was Verona, but I knew it was a cop. Yeah, has anyone got the do you fuck clip? Yeah, the way I was supposed to say it was like, do you fuck? But it doesn't really come off right with a... The front man voice changer and accent I was doing. Devs had different masks? Not necessarily. But I tried to get the cops in the circles and then everyone else in the triangles and squares. But I don't think it ended up being like that anyway. But you could pick out the cops with like... Because I was obviously talking to the devs OOC. Um, and they knew what they had to do generally for the games anyway. But the cops at some points were kind of wandering around like headless chickens, like not knowing where to go. And you could point, you could like, kind of like pinpoint who they were, you know? Yo, calm with a form of resub. Appreciate that. Hey, yo, I thought I got protection. Do you fuck? <laughs> yeah, I'm saying, do you fuck? I'm not asking like, do you fuck? You know what I mean? Do I fuck? <laughs> I mean, if I got to, I guess. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, that's funny. 
loved the event, watched most of it from Penta's perspective. Ah, oh, shit. Yo, Simeon said with the eight months, pretty sure that Dutch wait over the prime for 10 months. Yeah, I'm pretty sure uh, Mike Block was the protagonist in that one. Nidas gets lead supporting role. That's good nominee. Oh. oh yeah, Kylie's the VIP it was great, yeah. So it was Dean and Jaeger. And then fucking Mr. K as well. Oh fuck. They're all so good. Dude, the amount of content creators in it and like all the great RPs really made that event like top notch as well. I don't think too many people were too salty, which is good. Hmm. But obviously people were naturally going to get a little bit annoyed. People had to get eliminated at some point, right? So. Yo, Raz with the gift is so appreciate that. See Rami fuck over Dante? Yeah, oh my god. That shit was so good. I was fucking dying watching that. You ever seen that clip from Pez as well when like um, they're on the last uh They're in the last room trying to get in. Let's see if I can find it in the Discord. Is anyone got the clip of that? I think somebody posted it in the Discord. Oh this is a. Uh, Hey, don't put it in yet. Quick, quick, quick! Don't put it in. Oh no, this isn't the full clip, but you you, you need the clip of him uh, coming up and like punching the fuck out of him. I believe you did this. <laughs> Not their mouth, though, right? Like, oh. no, from the grocery store, remember, oh, Michael? I... You showed me the way to the grocery store. I never, yeah, never, I, remember. Go, I never, ever, ever not find it again because you helped me. Stand the gold still, man, please. Just enjoy the sunset. I'm going, oh. I'm going to go get the supplies for Tug. I'm gonna get us a rope so we can finally play Tug. It's a beautiful sunset, Michael. Oh god. I'm so happy that you're my best friend. Oh god, yo. Damn you old stupid bitch. Damn you old stupid bitch. I can't wait to get home to all my kitties. Oh god, that was anti <laughs> Oh god. man, I got 24 marbles and the guy's so good that it was on the water as well. Hmm. Like he, he ragdolled like that. Refresh for a mo's back, hell yeah. A refresh chat. Again? No, this is the Bahamas. I come here like once a week, usually once every once every two weeks. You can go and grab what? a bungalow if you want. I didn't uh, do anything to come we got, here. We got Coronas on ice. And the I'm a good and the <laughs> what? And, the, and, and the, listen. I don't right? belong here. Listen, you're here. Okay. Sometimes uh. it makes sense. Sometimes it doesn't. But at the end of the day, we can't fight it. So we just gotta, <laughs> you know, we just gotta accept it and just move on. But I want to talk to whoever runs the joint. Maybe I can explain my side. No, nope, it doesn't work that way. What? No, nope, that. Oh. What do you mean? Oh my god, I just, just got, you just got seven, so <laughs> just go ahead, what? hang out, pull up a chair. No. Okay. Don't talk about it. I'm just, not gonna argue, relax. I'm not gonna argue my head. Okay. Yep, don't argue it, just grab a I, Corona. I, okay. Yep. One of my buddies, uh, you know, my house is up there. Yeah. Think, uh, <laughs> uh -huh. probably up there somewhere. Uh, I know, uh, uh, okay. That's fucking funny, man. Uh -huh. 
Dude, you fucking beelines for this. He's like, nah, fuck this. Oh my god. Quick, quick, quick! Beyond fucking punching a. Pond over there too. Get up! <laughs> the panic. They're escaping. No! <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, what's up, bro? What's up, bro? Let's go. <laughs> Dude, the fucking clutch save. Let's go, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, it's so good, man. Yeah, it's Taco. <laughs> Three games was elite, yeah. Props everyone involved making that happen. It was fucking pretty crazy. Hmm. Dude, and I think there was like a on tail grab as well. I could see like four. You know when the when it was blip, when it would do the blip thing, right? You could see through the walls and see everyone's tails. There was like four people in the in the mansion up, up top, like hiding in the elevator, and I could see it. And I said about three or four times, maybe go to the mansion, go up top, but there's someone hiding there, and nobody went there to try and grab someone's tail in there. Yo, Crip Sweetie with the 13 months, I appreciate that. Rami being Rami. Oh, did Tommy get fucked in the tail game? Benji, don't do it, Benji. Don't. It's not Benji, man. It's not Benji. Tommy, don't do it, Tommy. Do what? Don't walk away from me. Don't tackle me, Tommy. Lang, I'll fucking stab you, bro. Keep playing. You food, man. You fucking bad at this, I'll say, man. What the fuck you stab me for? How long do we have this fucking knife for? What the fuck is this? Told you, Snake, always. Told you, would. <laughs> Don't matter though, because I would have done it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> what the fuck? How did he die? <laughs> what the fuck did he die? Punch him and then like he flopped to the ground and took fall damage or some shit. Is PM not coming back now? Bring the PM back. It's just uh, find the right time to do it. I've just uh, been feeling a little burnt out recently. So, I've been uh, I've been trying to catch up with some stuff, chilling. Wake up, get up. I've had a headache the past few days anyway since the the whole octopus game shit. Uh, the list, yeah. Point four K. I've seen this. Fucking hush. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> oh my god, that's Ray. <laughs> oh, that's funny, man. There's no intro scenes. We're going to be recording them. Yeah, that's what we need to do say, actually. We're going to do that for a bit and then we'll jump into our pee. Um, also got Stuart working on some stuff for the charger. As well um, he's picking up where I left off pretty much getting it converted and all prepped ready for 
GTA. Where I, uh, I jump in and help with some of the, the police add-on stuff as well. Hmm. Yo, it's awful pop for the $5 there, no? Content, I was wondering if you could take a look at the LG Retro's top speed. Seems to only go 155. Sorry for pop you. <sighs> yeah, LG's a weird one because of the upgrades on it. Play more Underwood today. <clears throat> I don't know. I like playing Underwood, but I don't think Stream likes me playing Underwood too much. I like chilling on Underwood, just like patrolling, doing some shit, you know, chasing people. Like I was playing yesterday uh, off stream, just chilling out, trying to relax. I find it relaxing playing Underwood. Yeah, I was chasing a. Uh, I was chasing Buddha from a vault yesterday. I was on his fucking ass. There you go. Uh, yeah, I want to play Igor. Igor is draining, though. What about F2 and Pawal? When do you ever play Pawal? Ego and Francis, dude, that would be content. We don't play at the same time, though. <clears throat> and I think Coil finds the, uh, the ego voice irritating. Oh, shit, we're on 103 sub train. Damn. Deviant again with the 50 gifted bomb and the new gifties bought. I appreciate that. Says Francis. <laughs> yeah. He hates Ego. <laughs> I don't know why. Coil's like, Coil just fucking just doesn't like the Ego voice. Why you leak Charger? Bruh, what do you mean leak? Hmm. I was working on it on stream like fucking months ago as well. Dude, that was time ago when I was working on the charger on stream. That car looks nice, but the muffler seems exhausted. Mm, more time lord arc. The thing is with the time lord stuff, I don't think it's that. I don't know. I feel like uh, a lot of the Halloween stuff um, has been a little overdone. Hmm. Yo, the Grande Badger again with a five months. Appreciate it. Ripley Dolphin with a gifted sub to Stuart. And AJ Weller with a six months. GG Life with a prime. Appreciate it. Because, like, some of those uh, unique characters, right, that pop out and they've got these unique abilities and stuff, um, they're cool to see, right? Like, uh, Edwin was one of those characters. Um, it's, like, cool, like, when Edwin pops up, it's going to be, like, some cool, wacky shit right but it's not really that special anymore because of all these characters that have popped out uh, over october and uh all the big events that were going on and shit chat your cute people shy yeah I, I don't like when we do the bigger like the the crazy wacky stuff i don't like it when it when too many people are involved because it can spoil some of the... Not, not the seriousness of some RP, but like... I don't wear it. It can interfere with a lot of RP, RP that might be going on, right? And it can downplay some of the... the uh, it can downplay some of the... The immersive storylines that are going on, right? Does that make sense? Yeah, messes with immersion a bit when that stuff's overdone. I think it's good every now and then. But, like, when I do my stuff as well, like, if it's, uh, 
Maybe it's the Time Lord stuff. Hmm. You know, I've uh, I've always gone with the idea that we should keep it isolated to a group, right? Like uh, when I was doing Time Lord stuff with uh, the nerds and Buddha or or like with CG, we keep it to those groups and we isolate it so that you know we could uh, and we would always drug them up as well. So like if if at any point we need to say, oh, you guys are just high, you can always go with that excuse, right? You guys are just seeing shit. <sighs> but it's like now where everyone's seen all this crazy shit going on. That does it really matter if we take those precautions, right? You know what I mean? Hi, huh. So I feel like I think it'd be good to retcon everything that happened in October. Obviously, it was cool, fun stuff for, for Spooktober, right? But I feel like also all that crazy shit that was going on shouldn't really be canon. Some people will take it as canon and talk about it. I don't know. But, you know, I was I was taking part in it as well. I was having fun just fucking around doing some stuff. There's some wacky characters. I was playing uh, Bane. It was fun. I just feel like... Uh, hmm... I just feel like if we overdo it and we bring too many people into it, it can spoil some some immersive storylines, basically, is what I'm trying to say. I said it best in picks like an episode of Simpsons. Yeah. Yeah, true. I think we can mix and match it though, right? Like you can have those really immersive stories. Like think of the tuna shop versus Cerberus, right? That was fucking sick when that happened. Could you imagine when that RP was going on and then like fucking the Batman appears in front of you? Like how that would downplay that kind of story. Obviously the server's in a different spot. But that's basically what I'm trying to say. Obviously that doesn't happen all the time. And it probably didn't happen during those events, but it could uh, mess with the immersion of it. That's what I'm trying to streamer? say. Haven't seen this guy ever before, lol. Happens to the other loading screen you're working on? That was ages ago. I, I never got around to finishing some clips for that. But for the for the uh, for the so what I need to do today for the new no, the new uh, loading clips. I know I've been stalling for like an hour, but um, grand a badge with a thousand bits. Thanks to you and all the other devs and admins for that amazing work with the Octopus Games. I had a blast. One last tug, Sanch. I need to put Larry's on this car, actually. I need to prep it for Larry. Oh, fuck, there's so much shit I need to do. <laughs> I suppose games will make you excited for what can be done going forward. Uh, yes, but the thing is as well, the reason it was done so fast is a lot of the devs were passionate about it, right? But, you know, they've seen Squid Games. They want to do this fun, th fun thing so they could pour some passion into what they were doing and crank it out quick, you know what I mean? Because they wanted to do it. Um, that's a, that's a, hmm. I mean, that's an issue that we, we have from time to time, right? Like people get burnt out, devs get burnt out. Um, but when something comes up that you really want to work on, um, hmm, that's when we can crank shit out fast like that, right? And, uh, if we just say, oh, we're going to do another event, but the devs heart, hearts aren't really in it, then I don't think it'll be as doable, you know? Yo, hot drink pack with the four months. Appreciate that. 